Hi Virgo, welcome to my third channel, my Virgo only channel. My name is Chelsea and this reading for those of you currently in a third party love triangle connection, we're going to find out what's the most likely outcome of this situation in the near future. Today is the 12th of October 2024. Time here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia is 6 uh, 6 22 p.m and virgo as usual i'm giving away free personal reading once a week for a lucky winner to enter hit like subscribe and comment below i love virgo if you have commented before you can do it again it will increase your chance in winning and winners will be announced on the community page weekly are you ready virgo Spirits and angels, please show me for virgo currently in a third party love triangle situation what's the most likely outcome of this connection in the near future. Whoa. Please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you, your person, and the third party. Page of Pentacles and Mothers at the bottom of the deck. Your person could be a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, very, very strong fire. Could also have, um, could also be Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, the Page of Cups, a little bit Earth here, Virgo, Capcom, Taurus. Can be any sign, okay? I feel like Virgo, your person is still very immature, okay? Page of Cups, doesn't matter how old they are, but they seem really immature. So they will say things that you may want to hear. Or, you know, this Page of Cups can be quite playful. And the chariot here is in reverse. And the sun. I feel like there could be an offer coming in from your person. Whatever the offer is, I feel like it has something to do with like a new beginning with the sun, but the chariot is in one verse. Maybe the, um, I feel like your person might say something to you where it might sound really, really enticing. And also I'm hearing like making excuses to really move forward right now, like Basically saying things to delay to to delay taking certain actions, important, serious actions towards solidifying this connection. Okay. I've also got the Emperor here, strength in my verse, King of Wands in my verse. I feel like they're I feel like they're gonna tell you something. I'm trying to do my best with the emperor. I'm trying to do my best. It seems almost like whatever they're going to be telling you, like they are going to, as though they are going to step up, okay? But the strength here is in my verse and the king of wands in my verse. They may give certain excuses about how they can't do certain things right now. Either it's because... I feel like deep down they could be kind of afraid. This this can be quite a you know cowardly energy. And the King of Wands in reverse again could be a, a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. This is the player energy, but I feel like they're gonna tell you something. They're gonna say, "I will step up. I will you know just hang in there." Seven of Wands. They will fight for this connection, or that they might tell you to. You know, stay, don't go yet, five of pentacles in reverse, possibly because of either children, the son, or it could be because of money, codependency, financial codependency, or home situation with their person. Okay, again, bear in mind, it could go, you know, roles can be reversed between you, your person, and the third party. Third party as in love triangle situation, okay? The fool is right here. Some of you, Virgo, you... <laughs> I feel like 50% of you might stay and just see what happens. But another 50% of you might just decide 
you know, this is not for me. I'm going to liberate myself from this this uh, third party love triangle situation. Virgo, make sure you subscribe. It's free to subscribe. And bear in mind, this is a general reading, so it's not as accurate as a personal reading. So if you want to book me for a personal reading, all info is below. Got the Empress here. Queen of Swords and Love first. The Magician. This is actually your energy. But I do feel, um, Virgo, this is you, right? The Empress... Oh, the Empress and the Emperor, but normally the Empress is the original partner. You could be the original partner or you could be the third party. Again, feel free to roll reverse, okay? But there is also the Queen of Swords in reverse here. A lot of resentments. Could be the third party or you, resentments because of being put in a third party love triangle situation. This is the original uh, partner, a uh, couple, the emperor and the empress. And they are both in an upright position though, so. And there's another page of pentacles in verse indicates immaturity, insincerity. So someone, I'm just going to say someone, okay? Someone could be you, your person, or the third party. The Queen of Swords in reverse. Someone is going to hold our grudges, a lot of resentments, or setting an ultimatum. When, when are we going to make things official? When are you going to leave your person? When are you going to decide? When can we, like, just be finally free with the fool and start, like, a completely new life? Virgo, um, there's another option to book me for, uh, to get a free personal reading with me, okay? There are a few options. <laughs> I've already mentioned it before. But on the 15th, which is just going to be in a few days, on my main channel, I'm going to go live. And during that live stream, I'll, I'll be giving free personal readings. Anyway, so make sure you subscribe to my main channel. We've got the Eight of Cups in my first, Six of Cups, Page of Wands. Another page. <laughs> I feel like Virgo, somebody here doesn't want to grow up. Somebody still wants to explore. Somebody still wants to, you know, try new things. And the magician, somebody is still like deceptive, trying to pull all the strings, like do whatever they can to continue with this lifestyle or to be in this third party situation, love triangle situation, six of cups. For those of you, I think children could be a factor. There's always, there will always be excuses to go, to return to somebody. Eight of cups in a verse, yeah. Returning, whether it's them returning to you or returning to the, the, you know, the third party, but there are always excuses about I, I need to stay or I need to go there or I need to see that person. But I feel like Virgo, you are the empress, right? So make sure you know your worth and your value unless roles are being reversed here. But then there's going to be I do like the fool and the sun here. So somebody is going to decide, you know, to have this new life, new start without this person. Because the fool is essentially alone and there's a little uh, puppy there. If you have kids or if your person has kids with the third party, I don't know whether you are the original partner or the third party, but because it's a general reading, yeah. But um, Virgo, somebody is going to decide, you know, I don't need you. I don't need you. I'm just going to be free. Take my kids or take my belongings or take my life and then go somewhere else. But for another 50% of you, Virgo, maybe there's this, you know, maybe someone is going to decide, I'm going to fight for this connection and then we can start over starting fresh, okay? Okay. 
just stay where it resonates, Virgo. I no, actually, I don't really like to do general readings because, you know, it's obviously one shoe, sh one shoe doesn't fit all. <laughs> um again if you want to book me for a personal reading all info is below or try to comment below i love virgo to be in a running to win a free personal reading with me um it's a once a week thingy but on my main channel just love tarot once a month i'm gonna be giving free personal reading during my live stream but i'm only gonna be on there for one hour or a little bit more um and that's it. <laughs> Anyways, take care, Virgo. I hope to see you back here again soon. I love you. Bye.